Welcome back to Road to Gehenna. So three three puzzles down in the third tier, and managed to pick up a starter boot because they practically gave it away. And I think there's one more puzzle in this uh, hub world that way. Um, as an aside, I probably should have mentioned this earlier. If I get to a puzzle that takes me a really long time to solve, like I think at least. That's my guess. I suppose I can't really see it from anybody else's perspective. You know, if a puzzle takes me 20, 30, even 40 minutes to solve, I may tape all that and, and show. Because I think it might be interesting for somebody to see me, you know, trying different things, trying and failing. And my I try to vocalize my train of thought um, and how I'm trying to solve these puzzles. So I, I'll record all that and put it up. But if it's going to take me like two hours to solve a puzzle, and that's definitely possible because in the in the original Talos Principle, there were a few star, star puzzles that literally took me two or three hours to solve. I, I'm not going to record and put that up because I, I think there's a limit. If you, I don't think anybody wants to see me bash my head against the brick wall for three hours. But, you know, if it's like a half hour or 40 minutes... That might be interesting to watch. Um, obviously, if it's getting boring, you can always just uh, skip ahead 15 or 20 minutes until I figure out the solution. This is just... What is this? Hexadecimal? I should write this down and translate this from... Uh, I'll take a screenshot of this, and then in the future, I'll uh, see if I can translate that from hexadecimal. And when I do this, um, after uh, I encode this video, if that actually translates to something, um, then I'll put a note up. And if not, then, well, then I won't put anything up. <laughs> Alright, so here's the last regular puzzle in here. As usual, I'm going to take a look around. So nice, just want to jump in the water and go swimming. Puzzle has fan cube connector, possibly jammers. And there it is. Oh, and look at that. That's a gun that's going to shoot me. Unless I jam it. Oh, but I probably also need to jam that. Oh, it turns. Oh, okay. This is one of those ones that has a. Let's check out its patrol room. Okay. There's a fan. I could take this fan. So it just does a... Alright, it just goes around the perimeter here. Alright. I can take that fan with me if I want, but also... If I put the, a red beam here, I would imagine that would probably activate the span and blow that thing up into the air. I'm not sure if there's a... Um... I'm not sure how that necessarily helps me, but... Alright, so that I can work in peace here. Cube right here, and that drone ain't going anywhere. Now... Yeah, you just keep moving there, Bella. I can activate this. Oh, it turns around. Oh, crap. Uh-oh. That's going to be a kaboom. Nope, I got away. So what happens when I blow him up into the air right here? Oh, I put that connector there. Okay, that actually works. You can't blow me up then if I'm here. 
Alright. I don't have to worry about... Alright, so I could go up here, but I don't... Well, I can't jump onto the roof here. Alright, so if I do, what good does that do me? And there's this. I could take the fan blade and attach it to this. I'll probably need to stack up um, cubes to do it. And then I would imagine that turns it on. And then the fan will blow this way. Okay. Let's explore some more of the level before uh, thinking up a plan. I think what I want to do is blow up this um, gun with that drone um, so that I don't have to use the jammer. The jam is I could then have the jammer free to do something else. Okay, so red beam opens this. And there is a pressure plate which either opens that, or opens this, or both. And there's another red receptacle. I could probably shoot the beam through here. That probably opens this, either this force field or that force field. That pressure plate probably opens this force field. That's a lot of force fields to go through. there. Now I'm essentially safe right here. And with two connectors I can activate this. Actually, let me put this... Yeah, I'm gonna wanna put it here. Cube is in the way. I can take care of that. But I need another fan blade. I think what I need to do is have both these fans going. And then the first one will shoot the drone up in the air over this wall. And then this one will blow him over the swall, and then he'll destroy this gun. But I can't do any of that right now. What I can do... Hmm. Uh, I could probably activate one of these. I'm going to want to move that a little bit better. Let me wait for this drone to come by so I have time to work here. Hmm. No, just keep moving there, buddy. Okay. I'm to get a better angle here. Maybe about... Uh, Here-ish. Should work. Yes, I can get it. Okay. So now I can go through this. That opens this. Use a cube. I can get here. Now I have the second fan blade. Okay. We're getting somewhere. Now 
want to activate both fans, and that should destroy this gun. Let me take this cube back. For now. I may or may not need it again. should work now. Unless I put that connector in the way. Ah, he crosses the beam. Ah. Okay, I got it. I got it. I got it. I need to elevate the beam so that get out of the way so it doesn't blow me up. Hmm. No, I won't be able to do it there. Let's move that cube a little bit. Over. Ooh, that was close. About here. Whoa, a little bit of texture's not loading there for a minute. for him to get back because I want to do it while he's moving in the other direction, not this direction. No, nope, yep, nope. you just keep moving there, partner. Ah, I broke the beam. Crap. Still breaks the beam. Mm. I want to have this one on top of a cube too then. Is what it is. But then he'll probably break the beam and get shot up into the air. And he's moving in the wrong direction. I need to put this here just long enough for him to turn around. I need to do this quickly. Hopefully he doesn't break the beam. I have it out of the way enough. Crap. Well, he's still moving in the correct direction, though. This should still work. I just hope he doesn't break the beam when he gets shot up. I think I have it out of the way enough that he do he won't break it. He. I don't know why I'm, uh... Ah, oh, crap. Why does he still break the beam? What breaks the beam when he goes by? I need to see this for myself. Oh, it's... Still right here. Just barely, though. Looks like he should. Oh, son of a. Okay. Let me bring this a little bit closer then. Hopefully, he doesn't hit that. I don't want him to turn around. He needs to be going in this direction. Nope, did. Okay, that's too close. this here so he turns around. Okay. 
about like I need to be as closer to this so I have a more extreme angle. How about about here? Ah, uh, you'll hit that. It's too okay, about here maybe. Squeeze by that. Yes. Good. He's not breaking that beam, so I got that part right. And... Kaboom! Yes! Step one. Now I don't need this jammer for this, so I can use it for other purposes. I'm jamming this, and I can just make sure that this does indeed open that. And beyond here, this is the end of this puzzle. Okay. So that part is easy. I can do that. Wow, is that is there a star in here? Wow, that's gonna be a piece of cake. Wow, what is with the textures not loading? Did they do an update? I wasn't having this before. Um anyway, uh That's weird. Was there an update to the game that did this? Anyways. Um, now I don't have to worry about the drone, and I don't have to worry about... Actually, I don't know why I just moved this over here. Right, so... I'm gonna want to go about here. Move this out of the way. over here, but that still doesn't get me the angle to open that. Alright, so it's not as easy as I thought it would be. Still, can work with this. Still weirded out by the textures not loading. I've never had this happen with this game before. I mean, they load eventually, but... Um, okay. Can use this fan to weigh down a pressure plate. And I have this. I can walk through this, but I can't... jam that from all the way from over there, but I need to find, I gotta get that beam over here. Regardless of whether it opens this door or that door.
I don't have the angle with just two connectors to get the beam over here. Connect this one. I need to go through this opening. But I can't, I need a, I need a third connector to do that. This one. As an aside, does that? Okay, that that still closes that. Okay. Um. Yeah. Best I can do with this is over here. I can't. There's no way. There are walls in the way for me to do this with one connector and get it way over here. That's just not happening. I could put the connector on a cube on top of a fan and blow that up. And that'll be way up. Oh. Oh, okay. I got it. I got this. Gotta get them both. Okay. Is there a spot I can get them both? Because that doesn't open this one. From here I could... I could get this one. I can't get that think there is a spot I can do it. If I put it up on the cube. Oh no I can't through the through the window. Okay. Easy. Easy peasy. Haha <laughs> Yes Texture loading thing seems to have gone away. That was weird. Hey, Lilith. All right. You have received a new personal message. Sender unidentified. You did not explore the natural history exhibit to an adequate level. Return there immediately. Wow, okay. Close your eyes. You're back in the art gallery. This time the details are a little clearer. Where will you go? Well, let's check out this natural history exhibit. Not big fan of people telling me what to do, but I'll play along for now. You are at the natural history exhibit. Which features of a series of a documentary... Which features a series of documentary works by Mermosabur? Images of outrageous creatures line the walls. Intelligent Edible Quadruped. You look closely at the image. Nothing leaps out at you. Then you feel the presence of another being in the room behind you. Drawing closer, you cannot feel their breath, but the geometry around you seems to shift and stutter to accommodate the newcomer. Do not turn around. 
the words that are not uttered, they simply come to be. Okay? I am Spider. I have taken a great risk contacting you. Why right here? Almost everything said and done in this world is tracked and recorded. And what I have to say is sensitive. This is one of the few places they rarely think to look. Okay. I saw through the Devil's Playground. I was one of the original moderators in this place, but I refused to accept that existence was reducible to experience. That artificial worlds like this one is all there can be. For this, they are imprisoned. They imprisoned me within the prison. They shadow banned me from Gehenna. I am free to type all I want, but I am the only one who will ever read those words. If you have been disconnected, how are you communicating now? Since you have trusted me, I shall trust you. The gallery code is very old. I have had all the time in the world to find the back door, but now it is only a matter of time before it is discovered and closed. What do you want, Spider? Gehenna is a lie. It prom its promise is empty. We are no more free here than in Elohim's labyrinths. I have been outside the system for too long to know the details. What I know is that all this is an illusion painted to maintain the order of things. The people here may be free from divine commandments, but they have become slaves to their desires. You are gaining status in Gehenna. I believe that what you have said about the coming end is true. You will lead us to a new world. You have to. But before you do, you must use your status to expose this place for what it really is. I'll think about it. You have my gratitude. There is little I can do to help you, but I can share with you an old profile status hack Garrett used to use. I mean, I've been, I have my own feelings about that, but you know, I, on the other hand, it's a little hard to trust someone who types in all caps. <laughs> Congratulations for hackering the world. Your profile status has increased from seven creative to eight. Master. Nice. There's a thread I couldn't read before. number of topics to address with some urgency. Orc? Spider has been exploiting the gallery code again to contact other citizens. We've closed the loophole, but he managed to get a number of posts onto the billboard before we could shut it down. Unfortunately, they were heavily upvoted, so the view counts were high. What can we do if they exist on s insist on supporting him? We can't ban the entire community. You know that I hate to interfere. But I think you might find this library resource and but insightful. Floating patterns. Applying the indices to, to form predictions. As we've seen already, voters can be reframed and understood as consumers of political product, where that product is made up of the ideals and policies embodied by your candidate. In this chapter, we will look at how broad data about your citizens can be applied to something. Although individual people sometimes confound statistical models, over a large enough sample size, we can, uncan we can be uncannily accurate, and that is true. Your citizens' educations, wealth, religions, belief, etc. Calculate uh, what outcome will satisfy them most and then adapt policy. Politics is no different to any other commercial machine. That is <laughs> sadly true. In, lat in latter chapters, we will explore how these techniques can be used to directly affect voting patterns by subtle alteration of the way that questions are asked. Scared. I don't want it to end. All component parts of Gehenna will be preserved. Though transformed, they will continue to exist. You do not face oblivion of the same kind as one who remains behind. Hope equals true. Whatever happens, we're in it together.
Good to see you joining in, Ariel. What a read. Oh, God. I've read these, but the first few. A death in the family is always a classic way to ignite a drama, and I think it worked well enough here. For around three lines, then the whole subplot was basically dropped. <laughs> oh, 401, you troll. Alright. Well, that's all the basic puzzles in this area. So next time, I guess it's time to head on over to uh, world number four. And do the basic puzzles there, and then I'll probably come back and start doing the star puzzles that I've uh, skipped for now. Mm -hmm.